Yeah, I mean, for a guy like you that is, exp- I mean, think I think you found like this really amazing and enviable balance between the arena shows and yeah, all the fucking craziness of rock, and then chirp, chirp. Chirp, chirp. <laughs> you know, like you've kind of like, ouch, ouch, fucker. Slap. I mean, it's, it's really kind of cool, man. Like you've, I mean, and also like being sober, like you've kind of like found this interesting piece. Yeah, yeah. Slowly. I'm not there yet, but you know, it uh, more will be revealed, you know. It's a, it's a, you know, it's a journey. And I, I once I realized that it's just a journey, I'm okay with it, you know. Um, someone on a, another interview was just asking me, hey, you know, back in the early days, you guys released an album almost every year. You know, you've got like five, you know, five albums in six years or something. And what happened? You know, it was eight years since the last one. It's like, dude, there's a lot more life to do. You know, <laughs> there's a lot, you know, vacations with families, watching my kids grow up, um, uh, you know, touring a lot longer than it used to be, you know. Shit, back in those days, we had this many songs, and this is how many gigs we can do, and then we're back in the studio. So a lot is happening in life, and uh, it, everyone in the band is on the same page, which is really a great thing. Um, we've all got kids, and we've all got other lives, but we can't live without Metallica, man. <laughs> it's just something that joins us. You know, we're these friggin' four married guys that know more about each other than anyone knows about us, maybe our wives. But, you know, the fact, you know, Lars and I have known each other for 35 years. Wow. Even maybe 36. But I tell you, that I don't, I there's nobody else I've known longer uh, except for maybe family than Lars. So it's a brother, you know, he's a brother. I hate him. I love him. I want to kill him. I want to <laughs> hug him. All that all that stuff, man. 